Hello my friends, this uh, video is about a review. I'm going to review Count Raven's High on Infinity. For those of you who aren't familiar with Count Raven, they are a doom metal band from Sweden. They formed back in 1989. They're still active and they're still touring regularly. High on Infinity is their third full length album. It's released on Hellhelm Records back on November 9th of uh, 1993. It has 13 songs and it's approximately an hour and seven minutes in length. The lineup of this album is Dan Fondelius on guitar and vocals, Tommy Wilbur Erickson on bass, and uh, Chris Renfield Peterson on the drums. Count Raven have more of a traditional type of doom metal sound. Uh, they also do contain some elements of what would be referred to as epic doom metal. I would compare them to bands like uh, St. Vitus, Black Sabbath, Trouble, and Candlemas. The sound of this album is very thick, very full, very audible, very clear. The songs are very memorable as well, lots of great verses, great choruses. Also, a lot of the bridge sections are very memorable as well. Uh, lots of great riffs, of course. Uh, Dan Fondelli's his vocals are very melodic, very clear. Uh, they are oftentimes compared to Ozzy Osbourne vocals, and they definitely resemble his vocals, that's for sure. Uh, the lyrics, uh, they deal with a variety of different issues, everything from conspiracy to political and social issues. Uh, some of the songs do contain keyboard, for example. The song Cosmos and uh, also the song Dance are very keyboard driven. Those aren't necessarily metal songs at all. They're very keyboard based. Also the song Ode to Rebecca is more of an interlude of sorts. Uh, it's kind of a shorter song, but it is fitting. Uh, of course, most of the songs are slow. There are some uh, more mid-paced songs. For example, the, the song High in Affinity and uh, Lost World have more of a mid-paced type of sound. So yeah, that is, uh, it is a very good album. I'm surprised this album isn't uh, as well known as a lot of the other doom metal albums that are out there. Very good, very memorable. I, uh, to me, I don't have any issues with this album whatsoever. Uh, to me, it is it's perfect. It's a phenomenal album. I've been listening to this album since I was in my mid-twenties. I absolutely love it and I still listen to it regularly. So yeah, if you're not familiar with this album, definitely check it out. Count Raven's High in Affinity. Alright, thank you very much for watching. Have yourselves a good day. Take care.